Hi, welcome to Word Live. Um, big political news going on at the minute, um, well-documented discussions between Scottish and English Parliament in a really interesting debate. So um, yesterday it was reported that Scotland's Deputy First Minister, Nicola Sturgeon, um, accused Westminster of interfering in Scottish democracy. So um, that's quite an interesting and hot topic. So I'm sure they'll be coming out more and more today as the, the day goes on. Um, in quite interesting political times and um, today we're looking more at Genesis 7 and the story of Noah's Ark. So as I said yesterday, lots of us are quite familiar with the song about how the animals go in two by two and maybe some of us had um, toy sets when we were younger but it, this is one of the Bible studies that Bible stories that we hear a lot about as children and then it's really quite a challenging and tricky story as adults so what we've done at Word Live is got loads of resources together there's great visual stuff there's great factual stuff there's good meditative um, things so I hope that you find it really easy to engage in a potentially quite a tricky theological um, story and um, what I really love about this part of um, the story of Noah's Ark in Genesis 7 is that um, we've heard the build up to the flood and Noah living out in faith and being obedient to God. And, and now we're at that point where he's got the boat, he's got all the animals in it, he's got his family in it, and the floods have come, and the boat is, um, is floating, and everything else is wiped out, and Noah is living in faith, and just having to trust that God is who he says he is, and it is going to deliver on the promise he made for him. And in so many ways, we can identify with that at so many points, that, that what real faith in action is, is trusting that God is who he says he is and trusting that he's going to do what he said he's going to do. So hopefully that's an encouragement because with hindsight we see that it works out okay for Noah and um, and I think we know that when we put our faith in God that, uh, that he comes through. So that's exciting. I hope what we've got planned for you blesses your day and uh, I hope in turn that you bless those around you. Have a really good Tuesday and see you tomorrow. Bye.